Jo und herzlich willkommen zurück zu einer neuen Folge von Genshin Impact und äh, wir machen weiter mit der Quest. Die Aktion ist zwar schon vorbei, das heißt, <lacht> eigentlich das ist es nur noch just for fun, aber naja, kann man nicht ändern. Ich meine, war einfach too much stuff. Oh, Lampenkraut, das brauche ich. Genau, trinke den Trank. Okay. Er brennt ein bisschen. Under normal circumstances, a repelling reaction is to be expected. But if the internal elemental flow is unimpeded, you'll only experience momentary discomfort. So you knew you'd be sick and still drink some? <laughs> It was my own concoction, of course. Only natural for me to be the guinea pig. Oh, but is it Perhaps it's just scholarly self-assurance. And it certainly speeds things up. In conclusion... I'd say we have our conclusion. As far as elemental energy is concerned, you're no different from anyone else in this world. Nothing peculiar. Ich will mal das automatisch ausprobieren, wie das so ist, von der Geschwindigkeit her. Better an ordinary result than a peculiar result. Peculiar results have a tendency to be of the undesirable variety. Okay, aber das muss man schon noch selber klicken. Okay, das wird aber verdächtig spezifisch. The good thing about ordinary is that everything is an object of reference and everyone understands you. People are the same, they can understand, empathize, encourage and support one another. When you're sick, a doctor can diagnose you because they are you. When something goes wrong, you can ask people who've made the same mistake for their experience because you are them. But a peculiar person, they don't have much recourse for the things we take for granted. The essence of their life is fundamentally different. For example, a human can't understand the life of a pyro regisfine or an eye of the storm. Have I explained it clearly enough? Ich glaube, ich begreife langsam. To sum up, this has been a positive outcome. Going forward, you can use your elemental power without fear. Timaeus, the results of the new experiment are out. If you could see to collating them. Just a moment, sir. I'll handle it. You gave me a lot to consider. Really stretched my limits. I'm thinking a lot clearer now. Having you down as an animal wasn't very precise of me. But starting with the premise of an elemental life form? Now that was... Not bad. I think it's an interesting line of inquiry. Whatever the truth of the matter, I'd like your research at the fore as opposed to my judgment. <clears throat> you can count on me, sir. I'll extract a result satisfactory to all. Is he trying to join the knights? He's starting to sound like a suck-up. Uh, what Paimon meant to say was, that's the spirit. Mr. Albedo, say something. Hmm. Before we can proceed with our research, I need to... prepare something. Wait one moment. If you're interested, why not have a look around? It may help to pass the time. Uh, das heißt, uns hätte ein, eine Quest gefehlt, wirklich? Ah, nein. Ich wollte schon sagen. Das sieht wie Alchem ein Alchemie-Arbeitstisch aus. Hier sind einige Tränke und andere Apparate ausgelegt. Benutzt der Beto diese, um die Welt zu erforschen? Das tut doch nicht weh, das anzufassen, oder? Do it. Paimon. Oh. Lol. Alter, what the fuck. Eine Tafel, auf der einige unverständliche Versuchsberichte kleben. Trotzdem merkst du, dass bei diesen Experimenten Fortschritte gemacht wurden. Ich finde es krass, wenn du hier so Sachen anklickst, dann kriegst du einfach Items, also Artefakte und sowas. Pretty insane. Ein Regal voller Bücher und Tränke. Es sieht aus, als hätte der Besitzer die angeboten, gleichzeitig zu lesen und Tränke zu erforschen. Did you see anything interesting? 
habe keine Ahnung, wozu alles gut ist. Not to worry. They're all for alchemical purposes. You'd be hard pressed to find an everyday use for them. Well, on with the research. There may be significant differences between different worlds. Take Tevat, for example. Here, those with visions can manipulate the elements. But worlds may well exist where only one person is able to do so. Or even everyone. So, uh, leaving elements to one side. Do you possess any... unique abilities? Ones that don't exist in this world? I think answering this question calls for the same methodology as last time. In other words, time for the next experiment. Ich habe genug getrunken, danke. No, no. You shan't be required to exert quite so much effort this time around. Now, see this pillar here? Use your willpower to try and break it. Äh, tut mir leid, ich schaff das nicht. That was your best effort? Hmm. Well, can't be helped, I suppose. What's with the disappointment? Isn't that, like, impossible? Uh, have you tried using your elemental power with food? I don't mean for cooking as such. Uh, rather, channeling your power into the ingredients themselves. I'm curious to see how the taste and texture respond. It may even help with proliferation. Ich müsste noch mal echt eine lebhafte Vorstellungskraft. I suppose I have a curiosity for things that others find surprising. Anyway, why don't you cook us up a sunshine sprat? I've just finished preparing the recipe. Cooking? Pana was looking forward to more mad scientist stuff. Not only is this recipe a staple for me, it's also worth experimenting with and highly nutritious. You're just hungry. That does sound yummy, though. Okay, Paimon approves. Ich weiß, worauf du hinaus willst. Mm -hmm. Good buddies are always on the same page. I'll leave you to it then. Looking forward to the results. If there's anything left over, maybe Timaeus can finish the last morsels. Uh, Paimon doesn't think we'll have that problem. How are we gonna channel elemental power into the food? Maybe try the willpower thing again. Ähm, um, hier. Ach komm, als ob ich dafür Lampenkraut opfern muss. Das brauche ich, um, äh, um irgendeinen Charakter zu graden. Ich glaube, äh. Was? Fische? Weiß nicht. That was fast. Looking forward to tasting. I mean. Testing the results. Hmm. An average outcome experimentally, but you really brought out the flavor. You seem well versed in the science of gastronomy. Oh. As far as the proliferation hypothesis is concerned, well, we've come up short. Seems like food presents the same headaches in your world as it does ours. Unless, could it be that the natural laws of this world are limiting your unique abilities? We just didn't know how to channel elemental power into the food. It's a little more complicated than adding herbs and spices, you know. Not to worry. At least we put some food to good use. No need to feel disheartened. And here's your portion. Enjoy. I can box it up if you like. Woohoo! Thanks! Glad you were paying attention. Paimon hat einen neuen besten Freund. I can tell that you're good friends. Paimon was keeping an eye on you and your safety during the whole experiment. Not that Paimon would have been able to do much if things had gone wrong. But anyway. Hey! You were being nice a second ago! But you do have tasty recipes, so Paimon forgives you. And you're right, we are good friends. You have good friends too, right? Good students? Uh, yes. I'm fortunate too, I suppose. Anyway, moving on to the next experiment. There are all manner of alchemical items here. Keeping them in their proper place is a challenge at the best of times. A while ago, I had the misfortune of misplacing a batch. I managed to retrieve the majority, but two vials have been evading me. Animal crystal fly elemental extract and electrohypostasis powder. Don't worry if you can't locate them. I was planning to replace them anyway. 
Though finding them would save me the hassle. If you had, say, a superpower, like night vision or vibratory sensing, lost property would be a thing of the past. I must have dropped them somewhere in the area where you were looking just now. So, guess we'd better take a look. Gegenstände sollten Spuren von Elementen aufweisen. Oh yeah, you can use elemental sight. Nah, let's just do it the old-fashioned way. Was? Vor allem, ich weiß nicht mal, welche Richtung er meint. Die Richtung, aus der wir gekommen sind, oder was? Alter, ihr seid gar nichts. What? Was für ein Scherz. Oh Gott. Oh no. Was ist das für ein Giraffe? Oh. Jetzt erst recht. Ach, das ist eine Truhe. Lol. <lacht> Mit dem Elementarblick gar nicht gesehen. Vielleicht da oben? Nee. Hm. Ich will nicht sagen, aber es... Äh, nope. Auf der Karte ist es auch markiert. Schon das Gebiet, wo wir gerade einfach drin standen. Oh oh. Ah, da war es. Oh mein Gott, das war echt versteckt. Als ob das hier einfach wirklich in dem Ding lag. Lol. Was für eine sinnlose Quest, Alter. Du hast sie finden können. Unglaublich. Ein tausend Dank. Ich frage mich, dieses elementale Sicht, das ist, was dich erlaubt hat, die Items zu finden und mich hier auf den Bergen zu finden, korrekt? Ja, ich glaube, es kann ein bisschen als eine Superpower sein, oder? Unfortunately. Though elemental sight is seldom seen, it is not unheard of in Tevat. Only a never-before-seen otherworldly power would be of benefit to my research. You mean, we failed again? Don't be disheartened. This falls entirely within my expectations. Besides, getting these items back, I'd call this a very worthwhile experiment. I have to commend your deduction that the items would contain elemental traces. Right then. Up until now, our research has focused on your otherworldly identity. Our research on your identity as one of us is just beginning. Bis zum bitteren Ende. In essence, the differences between humans are reflected in our intellectual and physical capabilities. Let's start with physical. Looking out from where we're standing, can you see what Sucrose is doing? Nah. And if you jumped from here and landed on that cliff, the one over there, Could you see her then? No. So what about if you planted a single blow on the mountain face here, and it burst into a million fragments? Then could you see her? No. Hmm. Then I shouldn't get too excited. Still, we'll gain a more thorough understanding with an experiment. I know of a location that will be perfect for a physical test. Please, follow me. Still in one piece! Good thing the vial's so strong! Ich weiß nicht, irgendwie ich mag Albedo einfach nicht. Der geht einem irgendwie auf den Sack mit der Zeit. Wait, müssen wir da hoch oder was? Ah. Damn. Nein! Oh. Ich dachte, man kann hier stehen, lol. Ach, 
als ob. Ach, als ob, man. Ach, das war wieder so unnötig einfach. Oh, wir könnten ein kleines Feier gebrauchen, ne? Verdammt. <lacht> sterben wir wahrscheinlich einfach während der Quest. Das beruhigt mich nicht besonders. Das ist genau meine Art Experiment. Then if you would please, I eagerly await the results. Wait a minute. While we're busy testing, what exactly are you going to be doing? Me? Recording data, responding to risks, providing uh, emotional support. So if you do decide to go swimming, you going to dive in with us? No. Unless you're thinking of conducting competitive research? Oh, ich weiß gar nicht, schaffen wir das? Ah, ja. Great work. I've never seen a performance quite like it. Your reputation precedes you, Traveler. The data shows that you're easily outperforming the average citizen in Mondstadt. But you followed us the whole way without breaking a sweat! Me? Actually, I used alchemy to cheat a little. But anyway, if it turns out that the natural laws of Tevat do not affect you, I should be able to make various inferences about the otherworldly civilization you belong to. If the natural laws of Tevat do affect you, then I shall be able to make inferences into the kind of evolution that would occur under the absence of such effects. The innumerable possibilities that this could present, the captivating insights, it would be something to savor again and again. But how does this help your research? You've helped me to unravel many of the problems that were holding it back. When we return to the campsite, I should be able to show you something interesting. Was hast du noch so gründig erforscht? I may be about to make some analogies between you and a few unusual specimens. I hope you won't be offended. Old, petrified trees, a sun eight times the size of our own. The essence of the investigative process is enthralling, but such feelings are inevitably fleeting in nature. I'm willing to pour all my energy into research, and yet specimens are finite. As the unknown transitions into the realm of scientific understanding, the feeling of enlightenment is lost. All these things that start out as objects of fascination end up possessing the prosaic mundanity of a sunsetia or a sweet flower. They cease to be noteworthy. Oh, so that's why you wanted to sketch those hilly churros? Because you got to see something new and interesting in the differences between them? Precisely. To quote my exact words from earlier, these creatures are, for the most part, quite boring, not worth closer inspection. There is precious little about them that serves to pique my curiosity now. So after all these experiments, are we gonna be, like, boring to you, like sketches? Of course not. You have been of great assistance to me, and I will remember this friendship for a lifetime. Now, before we head back to the campsite, there is one more experiment. Intelligence. Follow me. There are some other ruins nearby. Uh. Was wir noch machen könnten, wäre diesen Teleportpunkt da freischalten. Das ist irgendwie auch mehr oder weniger so der Leitfaden der Quest. Immer zum nächsten Teleportpunkt laufen. 
So ein kleines bisschen. Und äh, ja. Wenn wir das haben, dann würde ich sagen, Colin was ein Day. Und ich bedanke mich fürs Zusehen. Sehen wir uns beim nächsten Mal. Macht's kurz rein und ciao, ciao.